Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to add the credit card payment on Equid websites in 2024. Adding credit card payment functionality to your uh, Equid website is crucial for any online store. So this tutorial will guide you through the process of setting up the credit card payment using Equid integrated payment providers. And this tutorial is also perfect for those people who are just starting with e-commerce on Equid and it will help you understand the basics of integrating the credit card payment options. So make sure to stick by and let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch us from now till the end so you have full experience. First, you will need to go and open a browser. For me here, I'm using Brave where you can use whatever you want. Once you open that browser, go to the CRL section and basically just type equid.com and hit the enter button. If it's your first time, basically you'll find this option here. So click on login to log in into your account if you have an account. And if you don't have an account, click on start for free or get started for free to create a new account. For me, I'll just click on login. And normally I'll be logged into my store right away because I logged in recently. But if it's your first time, like for you, you'll find, I guess, these options. So you can log in with Apple, Facebook, or Google if you don't want to get through all the boring steps of creating or even logging in into your account. So once you do so, you'll find yourself on the dashboard right away in here. So here, once you do so, all you need to do is simply go into this list panel. Go here as example to payments. So once you do so, you find here pay by cash, which is not a credit card payment. So we can enable it or disable it, whatever you want, whatever suits you. And as you can see, you can simply even edit the action of pay by cash or name of it. As you can see, you can even set some payment instruction at checkout as example. So uh, on pay by cash, as example, if you wanna get paid via like a check or like with money, checks are not accepted, etc. Make sure to enter all those details or instructions here on this option. And the payments method fee, if you have any fees, make sure to add them right here. So this will require a plan, it seems. And you can even limit the availability by shipping methods also. Okay, or you get like payments by cash, but just in the United States, maybe, not in other countries. So other than that, I'll just go here, click on back. And as you can see, what we want to enable is this option with Stripe. So we can enable or add the credit and debit card payment. Of course, you can enable that even with PayPal if you want to. You'll be able to access payments with one of the world of most familiar payment system offer a one-click checkout for a seamless shopping experience. To start accepting payments, enter the email address where your payment should be sent. And this email address should be the same as one associated with your PayPal account. If you don't have a PayPal account, you can set it up later using the same email address that you've provided here. As example, for me, I already have that account. So I'll basically just go here and enable. And once I enable that as example, so updates PayPal to avoid issues with payments example. So I'll just go here and click on updates PayPal, which will take me to another page. Of course, you can even change the PayPal account whenever you want. And I guess, so I'll just go here to advanced settings. You'll be able to even to enable the PayPal checkout on the cart page and even show the PayPal credits button if you want to. So other than that, you can give it a name like PayPal or let's as PayPal. You can set some payment instructions at checkout. You can add payments method if you want, uh, fees if you want to. And yeah, so if you scroll down, example, yeah, here we'll be able to add, update that. So example, I'll just go here and click on continue. Check that I'm not a robot. I hate this kind of like I'm not a robot, but I guess it's fine. So just do that and cool. yeah. There's a car here, car here. I hate this type of like, you're not a robot, but I, yeah, as you said, it's fine. So sell this picture. And I guess that should be it. So yeah, click on verify. Okay, it's wrong. So I'll just go with the buses right now. As you can see, it will take forever. If you did like a wrong image, you'll have to go and do it again and again and again. And yeah, so verify now so yeah all good now i'm a human and yeah here you'll have to enter your password click on login and you should be good to go of course how would you use your accounts for primary use or for business etc just keep click on next and update your payments on paypal and you'll be good to go as i said that if you want to use like paypal as a payment method 
if you want to accept that credit card or a uh, debit card option if you don't want to use like uh, of course make sure to enable it as you can see paypal can be used as payment methods only when customer zip or postal code is specified for an order that requires shipping or delivery currently you don't ask your customer for zip code so, uh, zip or postal code at checkout to be able to use paypal as payment method turn on the ask for uh, zip postal code option and checkout settings so as example i'll just go here and yeah i'll just enable this one as an example save that go back to payment here and yeah as you can see i'll be able to enable it there's other option other than the paypal option as you can see other than the manual and etc so like this one more option to accept online payments uh, from your account for example there's some options here if you want to do it other ways to get paid even accept payments with your preferred uh, payments processor if you want to you'll be able to use or choose all of that so other options to add the credit card slash a debit card which is stripe connect your stripe account to receive payments with stripe so here i'll just go and click on connect and enable as an example this will take me to my store or my stripe account make sure to connect into your account so i'll just go here and enter my code without any problems click on submit and of course i'll have to get the code from my authenticator app as an example i'll just go here authenticator app and try to get that code so six two four and eight zero four an example click on connect you can even create a new account if you don't want to use your account at the moment and you'll have to go through uh, the simply checkouts not checkouts but you have to go through uh, like or find your information and a lot of other stuff i'm not going to do that because it will take like five minutes or so so i'm not going to waste your time you can do it by your own and simply once you do so you'll be able to enable this option so you can accept or add debit, debit card payments or credit card payments on your equipment store with paypal and stripe so that's gonna be it for me today thank you for watching and goodbye